Yeah, the ladder is gonna get streamed on this channel. People that's asking, but that's tomorrow. Odyssey. So I think Diddy in neutral is much better than Nest. But if Nest gets a hit, Diddy has a really hard time getting out of disadvantage. Mm -hmm. But Diddy beats that. Ness up in neutral and edge guards him really well. And ledge traps him really well. Yeah. Let's see what he does though. First punish he got, just a quick throw into the forward air. Monkey flip. Continuing to control the stage here. Yeah, just really using that range of the banana to kind of deny anything that Ness tries to go for, either on an aerial approach or on the ground. Very good control. Just He just needs to keep himself at a distance pace and then just guess how he thinks he's gonna get around that. Oh, nice, nice monkey flip cancel. Okay, off, nope, not off stage yet. But he's gonna choose to go to the ledge. Actually, Diddy has a lot of options at the ledge. If he does like beer burst banana pull and like monkey flip, it's actually not so bad for him a lot of times. Mm -hmm. Ooh, got close quarters for a second. Kind of scary oh. for Odyssey, but he just uh, jumps right out of there. Returns back to neutral. Oh. He went for the cheese, but he's fine. Yeah, he made it back. Barrels didn't explode on PK Chris either, so no harm, no uh -oh. foul. That banana's getting really scary. Oh, oh got it. Back throw? Oh, goes uh, for the dash attack. Didn't quite Back throw, read. Back throw wouldn't kill it that person. It, with good DI anyway. Mm -hmm. oh, oh, you're dead. Yeah, catch really, the monkey flip. Yeah, telegraphed monkey flip, unfortunately, for Odyssey. If the opponent is paying attention, they can react to hit you for that. Mm -hmm. Oh, he nice. Hit. Oh, yeah. I think yep. that, that was unfortunate. Nah, that was just really smart for Odyssey. He, like, wanted to use a banana to edge guard since he went low. Even if he gets hit by the PK flash, Ness doesn't have a jump, so mm -hmm. it's fine. Yeah, I couldn't quite tell. It looked like uh, he either just stopped his momentum or caught a jump or something with that banana. Very yeah, it good does a lot. Well. It's, it's like transcended or something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it hits a lot of things. Who, who thought a single banana peel would be would hold so much power? Bro, this move is broken. <laughs> banana is a, a broken move. One of the best projectiles in the game. Right. Easily. Who is a D drop? D drop out of shield, yeah. That's one of Diddy's fastest out of shield option, by the way. Mm hmm. Yeah, he got a decent punish too. He could have extended it further, but just a slight um, error. Not mm -hmm. quite able to extend it as far as he could. PK Thunder just circles it around the banana, gives Unsafe. him a little time oh. to think. Uh, this is that too. He's got a weird percent for that to, that combo to work. Normally mm -hmm. it does though. Like you can get banana trip, dare, banana throw, up B for like almost 40 percent. Oh. Yeah, definitely a lot of good ideas coming from Odyssey. Let's see how he gets away from this banana kill. Just oh. get a second, but the up smash gonna close that out. Dang, that sucks. I think he wanted to get up attack to like destroy the banana, but it didn't hit. Mm -hmm. Oh, and that, this is good for PK Chris. Okay, oh, he's gonna yep. take the LB, but he's still fine. Depending on how he gets off the ledge here. Nice oh, cool. catch. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. Nice stuff. Looks like he used the banana to just catch him in the middle of PK Rocket and then just close it out with the dare. Very nice. Yep. That's a. That's, uh... Guarantee bit down air if the banana hits on like pretty much every character. Mm -hmm. Alright, what's he gonna do with the banana peel? Just uh, gives himself some control. Yeah, I mean, when you're the opponent trying to use your enemy's projectiles, I feel like you need to have a lot of practice and just time with item play. Because yeah. uh, most of the time, I feel like it can hinder your neutral and plan if. Uh, you can't process what you want to do fast enough. Yeah. But PK Chris clearly knows how to play around the banana. Like He's not getting his hit by uh, the banana all the time. And he's not just like throwing the banana right back at Diddy Kong when he gets it either. So. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, let's see. Pretty much got an even game here. PK Fire comes in. Try to call out a follow-up. Have the right idea oh. and positioning, just not the right timing. Oh, risky monkey flip. Okay, he has him at the ledge again. He's gonna use the PK flash. He can potentially oh. Not oh my god. Yeah, I think he caught PK Chris trying to do a drop down double jump back on the stage. 
He either caught him jumping or Ness literally ran out of invincibility at that exact frame. Either way, that down air was just like, I don't want to say it was lucky, but <laughs> that was <laughs> very fortunate. Yeah, I think he just put a lot of good pressure. So I think he forced PK Chris to try and make a decision. And then before he knew it, he was going to take him out with that dare. That was very nice. Oh, you guys couldn't see the downer because of the lag? That sucks. No. Yeah. It, it looks like some people knew. Well, it, lo it looks like some people saw saw it, maybe. Oh. Possibly. Well, I guess they're going to fix this stream after this match. Mm -hmm. but, it's already uh, fine for me, but uh, we'll see. Yeah, it's, it's the stream, not us. You know, different is different than the Discord. Right. But anyway. Oh, no, I have, it, I, have it, I have the stream on my other. Oh, wait, never mind. I see it. I see what people are talking about now. Anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Either way, great start for Odyssey. A lot of pressure, a lot of damage. We say neutral over and over. Uh, PK Chris, kind of struggling in disadvantage right here. Yeah. Just keep getting red over and over. Oh. But well, here's P nice. okay, Chris's opportunity. Goes in for the PK nice Thunder. Gets a little juggle. Able to attack on actually a decent amount of percentage, but let's see what Odyssey does here. He's got the control and wow, just catches him running off the platform. Just calls him out with an up smash right there. Yeah. Super hard call out. Nice combo. Oh yeah, he's just like resetting neutral over and over. Every time he gets like a combo, he'll go back to neutral, see what PK Chris does at disadvantage, punish it. It's like stable DD play. Good DD play, I mean. But Ooh. nice side magnetic stall there. Cover the get up attack and then immediately get the backer. That was nice movement from PK Chris. Oh, try to fake him out with that PSI magnet, but saw right through it, able to get an extension. Continuing with the damage, nope, there's a landing there. Back to back. Back to neutral. This is a very aggressive DD player. <laughs> it's working really well. Mm -hmm. Definitely putting a lot of pressure onto um, PK Chris every time he wants to think of Ooh. an option. Again, the same exact option. Not quite able to take the kill this time, but he can do it oh. again. Ah, oh, it doesn't finish off. I thought he would go for a down tilt back there. there. Yeah, maybe he oh. caught him on that oh, low the <laughs> The barrels. Oh man, you love to see it. Not unfortunate for me. I love Diddy Kong. Oh, oh, double up the air, combos double are jump. not stopping. Yeah. Yep, unpunishable will be there. He actually, he actually faded back pretty far away. But there's the back there. Okay. Looks like he got caught in that PK fire. Couldn't jump out of it. Just got flicked and then got caught on that back air. Pretty much an even game. Right yeah, now, if the nest knows you're gonna mash jump out of PK fire, they just backer you, mm -hmm. reporter. Which pretty much everyone matches jump out of that. Yeah. And he got oh, the control, pulled out the banana, but then went with the monkey flip, covering all of his bases here. Bananas available. Man, just trying to keep the control here, playing it very safe. This is pretty much an even game. You can tell they're really testing the limits of their spacing here. Yeah. Didn't get that grab. Yeah, they're both playing really patient and neutral now. Oh! Got the Big ship. opportunity. Yeah, decent combo there. Kind of scary for Ness at the ledge, but... Oh! Oh, doesn't catch the roll in, but there's still a lot of pressure. Man, he's really trying to cheese him with these rockets, it looks like. Well, Really going into the stage, trying to catch him off guard, maybe, but... Not quite working for PK Chris. Oh, nice! Oh! Yeah, 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 yeah. Nice. Very nice catch. Yep, caught the monkey flip. If you know Diddy's gonna monkey flip high, you can just up air him mm -hmm. with most characters. Especially if you have a decent double jump like Ness. Alrighty, let's see. I don't I don't know, I don't know. Uh man, that would could have gone either way at the end, so I don't really have anything that I can say for Odyssey to do better. I think he played really well, honestly. That was just a really nice call out from PK Chris. Mm -hmm. Maybe just watch the monkey flips so much. Yeah. It, Easier I think said it was... than done. That move is like addicting as a demon. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's a great way to deal pressure, but uh, like you said, if uh, you know he's going to do it, then it's an easy up air. So. But 
I, it looked like Odyssey was trying to keep up the pressure, especially on that last stock. Didn't want to lose his momentum there, so. Yeah. I actually think he slowed down a lot at the end. That actually gave PA Chris some time to, like, reset and get, like, less pressured, I think. Right. At the end. But I think it was also because he was that kill person, so he didn't want to run into something silly. Good set, though. Yeah. I think we should go to a different stage, though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I let's think he had well, way too many good stages he could play on to stay on PS2. Yeah, let's see if we have the same thing as last time where, you know, both players are stubborn and just go back to the same stage every time. Looks like they're really thinking about their bands. I'm gonna have to give it a second. Uh, I don't know, any counter pick is good for Diddy on this stage list. Maybe. No, I don't know. Yeah, he's good on all the stages. Yeah, yeah really since Yoshi's Story and Lilat are banned, like, those are like the two of the stages I think Diddy isn't so great on, but they're not even legal, so. Yeah. Yeah, because the the slants really would mess up the, the ledge control with Banana, I can imagine. Yes. Terrible stages should never be legal. Oh, we're looks like we're at least switching the stage. We'll see. Or character? Question mark. Could be. It, definitely at least the stage. Well, let's see. Okay. Yeah. Same. Uh, same characters. Well, let's see where we go this time. Yep, Going to Kalos. Kalos. Okay. I figured, I figured Kalos are down. Diddy's, if he chooses to play this way, um, he can just run away from Ness on the platform so easily. Mm -hmm. Like, if Diddy goes on the side platforms and double jump monkey flip, it literally goes across the whole stage. Mm -hmm. He also, also yeah. can Go just ahead. walk leaning on this stage too because of the side. Right. Really easy to recover too. He has a lot of space to control too. I mean, he's got the advantage of having the banana and be able to control that space. But Ness kind of needs that little um, small room to work with because he has those uh, large hitboxes to work with. Yep. But here, there's just so much space, so he doesn't really have to worry about that as much unless he tries to go in crazy on PK. Yeah. He's already proven to be very aggressive when he has opportunity too, so I wouldn't be surprised if he, you know, continues to play that way. It's been working really well for him, so... Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see he's just trying to stay right outside the range of PK Chris's approach, space outside, and then go in with a monkey flip or a banana. Working out so far, just can't quite extend his punish as far as he wants to, it looks like. He gets, like, the last hit of, like, the dash attack and doesn't quite follow up with the aerial he wants. But he's got an opportunity. Goes PK out Chris banana. has some really good movement right now. Is that he's it's really hard to pin him down. He's yeah, not getting a... much stage control, but like he's just re rarely getting hit, so mm -hmm. that's really good for him. Yeah, but at the same time, you can tell that Odyssey doesn't really want to take the bait with any of these uh, PSI Magnet stalls, so he's just looking for his opportunity either on the landing or when he throws out a hurt box or something. Did he get cross? No. He actually avoided getting Z drop down here this time. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he makes up for his recovery. Here's a dash attack opportunity. Nice nair. Yeah, uses the, beat hit. Out the yeah, use the hitbox to just beat out the projectile. Very nice stuff. He might be looking for an anti air up smash. Uh, Odyssey, that is. Mm -hmm. It'll work. It'll work against the way that Ness is playing right now. But PK Chris calling out that jump from the PK fire again. Nice yeah. stuff. Very nice play. It looked like he was using those uh, double jump forward airs to. Oh, okay. There we go. Closes out the next stop. It looked like PK Chris was controlling like that mid-air space really well, so it was forcing Odyssey on the ground. Then he finally decided to throw out PK Fire and it caught him off guard. He was able to extend it into the back here and get the kill. But we got an even game now. Okay. I thought he was going to go for a down throw down air. <laughs> I would have done it. I thought he was just going to go even for a second back air, but he doesn't want to commit too hard to it, looks like. doesn't want to take any more unnecessary damage, so if he's unsure, it looks like he's not going for it. Mm. Really close match right now. They're both they're both playing the matchup really well at the moment. Through 
thought he was gonna go right there. Ooh. Oh, down air? <laughs> the neutral air too. Both of them pop up on each other, oh. but doesn't get an extension. Oh! Did he get Ooh. it? Almost. No punish. Ooh. It's actually kind of hard to punish, actually, when he hits your shield like that. He's going oh. for the shield break. He's going for the shield break. Yeah, he, he he jumped out just in time. I think he realized, oh, no, my my shield still looks like a peanut. Better uh, jump out of the way. Yeah. I wonder if uh, PK Chris has any practice versus uh, Rivers' is Diddy Kong. He's very right. good at this matchup. I think they're from the same region, that's why I said that. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. Kind of rough for Odyssey to land right now. Mm -hmm. Oh, he gets out of the way, though. Catches him trying to yeah. do PK cross and double barrel still. Oh, yep. no! Yep. Bad monkey flip. Bad monkey flip. Yeah, it looked like he, he thought he had the opportunity since he touched the ground and thought, okay, now I can finally go back on the offensive. But PK Chris was ready for it. Gets that up air, closes out the stock, gets himself a decent lead. Nice sag, man, Nick. Uh, no follow-up on the neutral air, unfortunately. Not able to get the back air. Back in neutral. Yeah, controlling that mid-air space again. PK Chris is so controlling. Not, not, not bad for Odyssey right now. If he gets to like 50%, that's where I would say it's kind of rough. But he has opportunity. Barrels? Oh, no, nope, they're not going to... They're not gonna ruin anyone's day today. Not Ooh. enough. I'll smash out a shield. Still not enough. Oh. Okay, that will do it. Yeah. Uh, 50 is kind of, kind of worrying. But if he gets a good combo, he can make that up. Yeah. Very easily. He can make it up, but it's also like a good percentage for Ness to really just either take on chip damage. He doesn't have to commit too hard, and he can just wait until he gets like a good back Ooh. throw or up air percent. Like going into high percents is definitely where it's scary. To go against Ness. Yeah, okay, Chris moving really well. It's so hard to pin him down and get a good punish. Oh, he, he tried to use the bat to reflect the banana suit. Yeah, I like the opportunity. Not quite able to execute it. Yeah, I think hard come back to me. He just doesn't have to rush this, and then he's pretty much got this in the bag, but we'll have to see. Yeah, really playing it safe, not wanting to commit too hard to anything. The banana trying to catch him on a jump. Yep. And he catches a monkey flip. Gets hard back air and it closes it out. Hard called out that monkey flip. He like knew that he would monkey flip there just because he had the banana in front of him and he didn't want to. He wanted to like get around it really fast. Like get back to center stage while being in the corner. But PK Chris like saw that coming a mile away.